This tutorial is a Newtonian fluid flow in LISA. The fluid is flowing in a circular pipe of diameter 0.2 meters, with a decreasing pressure of 2000 pascals per meter. Right-click the default analysis type, to change it to two-dimensional, non-Newtonian fluid flow. A cross-section of the flow in the pipe will be modeled, by using the circular plate template. Type 0.1 for the radius of the pipe. Due to the mirror symmetry of the pipe flow, only one quadrant will be modeled. To assign a material property to the elements, right-click the component in the outline tree, select Assign New Material. In the Fluids tab, select Herschel Bulkley. Type the value for the Critical Shear Stress, Consistency Index, and the Flow Behavior Index. As the velocity of the flow in contact with the pipe is zero, a zero velocity will be applied to those nodes. Activate Select Nodes, then use the Circle Selection tool, to select the nodes at the outer diameter. Hold the Control key down, then drag to deselect the internal nodes. Right-click Loads and Constraints, choose on selected nodes, then select New Well Z. Accept the default zero value. To apply a pressure gradient, activate the Select Elements mode. Drag to select all the elements. Right-click Loads and Constraints, select New Pressure Gradient Z, then type the value for the pressure gradient. Next, solve the model. To display the results, click the velocity magnitude in the solutions section of the outline tree. Click the tool button to show the vectors of the fluid flow. To view the arrows, rotate the model so that it is not parallel to the screen. This ends the Newtonian fluid flow tutorial. This model is a verification sample documented in the tutorials and reference PDF guide, installed with LISA.